zur Linie lichtenberg marlsdorf karlshorst gelangt. Mit dem Angriff Steiners wird das alles in Ordnung kommen. Mein Führer, Steiner... Steiner konnte nicht genügend Kräfte für einen Angriff massieren. Der Angriff Steiner ist nicht erfolgt. Es bleiben im Raum, Keitel. Das war ein Befehl! Statt hier Spaten, Sie seien befehlt! Der Militär hat es verjährt! Und doch habe ich allein, allein auf mich gestellt! Meine Befehle sind in den Wind gesprochen. Aber wenn Sie, meine Herren, glauben, it's everyone's favorite topic. It's time to dunk on a stupid e girl. Hey, look, just so everyone knows, I'm an equal opportunity dunker. Um, most streamers, I think, are degenerates, both men and women. Uh, and, uh, you know, when you look at people like XQC who just steal people's content and st sits there and does nothing. Or Hassan Piker, who just steals people con co steals people's content, collects five dollars from his twelve-year-old uh, wannabe socialist viewers. I don't think most streamers, most of the most popular streamers, add a lot to the cultural zeitgeist. Now there are a lot of people out there that do. They're generally not these rich, spoiled brats. Now you may have heard of an individual who goes by the name Pokey Maine. She's a Twitch, she's Twitch's most uh, beloved streamer. She's not even close to their most popular anymore. She's long been surpassed by much more talented personalities. However, uh, she rolled out some cookies. Some Mina cookies, which many believe are essentially um, a complete ripoff of another brand. The Tootsie brand. Uh which, look, many people saw that happen. She wrote these cookies. It's not uncommon for people to white label products. Now, for me, with coffeebrandcoffee.com, we do not do that. We pick all our own beans. We roast all of our own beans. We control the taste, flavor, and everything. The only place you're going to get our unique blends are from us. But that takes a lot more work. It's a lot easier to just slap your name on something and profit, especially when you have a built-in audience. And the biggest complaint for this individual was her pricing. For a four-pack of four ounces of these cookies, she wanted $28. It was $7 for a four-ounce bag, which is like, I don't know, four little tiny cookies. Not to mention, again, the brand that many believe she copied was $10. This is a brand that was discontinued, formerly sold at Costco. $10, but you had far more product. Far more product. So people complained that the product was expensive. And look, when you buy, like, look, even Coffee Brand Coffee, right? By the way, right now, our Black Friday sale is going on. It's 20% off the entire website, 10% off gift boxes, and 60% off our monthly's premium coffee club, Roaster's Choice, all week long. Make sure you get that. Um, stock up, get your gift box in time for Christmas and all this kind of stuff. Uh, you know, there, it is more expensive when you're small batch. There is a streamer tax, so to, so to say, or influencer tax, right? Um, I, can't buy, I can't buy coffee at the same rate that Starbucks can or even like Black Rifle can or these other. So it's like, you know, yeah, my, you know, my coffee is expensive. That's why I try to put it on sale. That's why I try to add value, things of that nature. But this is so expensive. It's actually insane. What was her response to people complaining about the price? Calling them broke. I am not kidding. So she comes out and says, Pokey main response to cookie pricing backlash after uh, broke joke fans. Or broke fans joke. She called her fans broke for not being able to uh, 
afford $28 for four ounce bag of four, four ounce bags of cookies. Just a, that's not even $28, $28 for 16 ounces of cookies. That's the price of weed. You can buy weed for that price. So when people complain about the price, this is what she said. When people are like, oh my God, $28 for cookies. It's four bags. Four bags of four ounces. Now, I don't know what the best, like, if I look up um, Chips Ahoy, okay, I don't know, you know, Chips, I just want to look Ahoy price. Now, I'm not saying Chips Ahoy are like the, the premium price, but here is on Amazon mini bags of Chips Ahoy. Wait, Chips Ahoy. Here's 20. Here's a 20 pack that includes two cookies each. Well, it doesn't say how many ounces it is. Oh, it's 22 grams. That's a, a one pack serving size. I mean, if, I don't know how many ounces are in a, 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 just a regular thing of Oreo cookies, but that's wildly expensive, wildly expensive. Here, a Chips Ahoy bag has 25.3 ounces in it and it's $6. And this is the, just so we're clear, this is the party size. 25.3. For seven dollars, she wants twenty-eight dollars for sixteen ounces. So this is nearly double the size, and it's six bucks. Now again, okay, it's Chips Ahoy. You want to say, eh, okay, maybe her whatever is. I mean, it is wildly more expensive. But this is what everyone was mad about when people are like, "Oh my God, twenty-eight dollars for cookies!" It's four bags. That's seven, seven dollars a bag. I know, I know math is hard. Seven dollars for four ounces of cookies, by the way, is already insane. Plus, she just seems like an absolute CNX Tuesday here, but it gets even worse. When you're an idiot, but. She calls people idiots. If you're a broke boy, just say so. <laughs> if you're a broke boy, just say so. You're a bro, you're, if you're broke, if you can't afford $28 for, I don't want to hear this $4, you know, I don't want to hear this. Oh, it's four bags. I don't, look, I'm a large individual. Okay. I get it. But I don't consider four ounces of cookies, a bag of cookies. That is a snack size of cookies. And look, I get it. But the hypocrisy is even more hilarious. Here you have, remember this, uh, this streamer was calling her viewers poor at one point, saying that they had to pay $5 or something like that, right? Here's Pokemon. If $5 is an irrelevant amount of money, then she shouldn't feel the need for your $5 stream subscription. If she argues it adds up, if multiple people give me $5, essentially here she is yelling at, you know, complaining and calling out another female streamer who uh, who called people broke, essentially. She she called them broke for not being able to pay $5. So Pokemon came in to say, oh, you can't do that. You can't do that. You can't call people broke. That's not cool, but that's exactly what she did. She literally called her fans stupid and broke. Here's that clip, mm -hmm. right? When people are like, oh my God, it gets $20 better too. for cookies? four bags that's seven seven dollars a bag i know i know math is hard when you're an idiot but i mean what a crotch and then yeah even mr beast cookies that are already expensive are only 450 for six ounces then this clip nope no and it's not because i got like 10 million dollars it's just because I'm good as I am. Why would I <clears throat> compromise my morals and ethics for more money when I have money? Something about that is so cringe. Oops. 
This is her admonishing somebody else for being capitalistic. No, and it's not because I got like ten million. dollars She's got ten it's million. Just Pay twenty eight bucks I'm for four am. little bags of cookies. You pores. Why would I uh, 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 compromise my morals and ethics for oh, she's more got money ethics. when I have money? Something about that is so cringe. It's so cringe, to guys. Me personally. Yeah, it's cringe. Like I, I understand. You know, if you, if you need to make money, right? Yeah, it's cringe. For for me to do cringe shit when I have my I can't. Twenty eight dollars for four bag four tiny snack size bags. Where I'm from, a four ounce bag of cookies is called snack size, lady. And again, look, I have a quote unquote influencer brand too, right? I understand my coffee at Coffee Brand Coffee is more expensive than Costco brand. I think it's better. But undeniably, there are economies of scale that happen to where other companies can also put out high quality coffee at a cheaper price. As my company grows, I'll be able to do that. Okay. But I understand that, you know, when you're a small company, but this price gouging is insane. And then, of course, she relies on, I don't know if you're familiar with the term. So I don't even care that her stupid cookies are an obvious white label and she just marked it up to say it's her brand. I think that I'm more mad or hilarious or on oh, blocked, of course. I think it's more hilarious that she deployed the Schrodinger's douchebag excuse after getting roasted. What Schrodinger's douchebag is, is when people say, I was just joking after, after saying something insane, right? Well, so somebody said, this has to be a joke. She finally responds and says, well, what I said was 100% intended to be a joke. I see why it came off as insensitive. She didn't seem like she was joking to me. And I apologize for that. I also understand the current price of the cookies may be expensive for some. I promise we'll cons continue to consider pricing to keep my $28 cookies as affordable as possible. You also see, was this also a joke, Pokemon? There's some confusion about the product I launched, and I'm here to set the record straight. <laughs> this is so scummy. She's preying on her stands, wringing them out like a rag for every last penny. She responds, you're a dumbass who lacks reading comprehension skills, so you resort to regurgitating idiotic incel rhetoric instead of easily reading up on the basic food industry practices, praying for you. So she calls them incels, poor, and stupid for not buying tw her $28 cookies. Good business practice. By the way, I think you're all smart, good-smelling people who have all the bedroom relations that they could ever want. And I sell coffee, tea, cocoa, and guess what? I also sell premium snacks. I think we have the best peppermint bark you're going to find anywhere, and it's only here for Christmas season. We've got peppermint bark. We've got chocolate-covered sunflower seeds, sea salt, milk, chocolate caramels, kettle corn, popcorn, saltwater taffy. All these snacks that are much more affordable and on sale right now for Black Friday. Hmm. You know, maybe check that out. Link in the description.